This is the shop. Apparently there's a line. They're only allowing three people in the shop. Look at all look at all that place. God damn. Sean, we're, we're almost we're almost there. We're almost there. Probably gonna get probably get that one. Gonna get this one for sure. Sham. Yeah. You're just waiting. <laughs> oh. Okay, I, 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 I love this bowl yeah. because of the texture. This is actually it's art. Let's put it up against the light. It's beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. So, so Sham, Sham here is a food stylist. You can add him on uh, Instagram. What's your Instagram? Yeah, so my Instagram is foodstylist by what maybe. Food stylist underscore by White Rabbit. I'll put it in the description below if you need it. That's him and stay tuned for his food rating. What's up, y'all? Today, I just came back from uh, Bendang Artisans. And today, I'm just going to do an unboxing product review of the plates that I bought. So I can't wait. Bubble wrap and nicely designed. Whoa, look at that. Look at these bowls. Beautiful matte light blue ceramic handmade bowl. I got these for this is 89 ringgit. 89 ringgit for this one. So let me tell you something about the about this brand Bandak. So this brand was actually made by an artist called Rosanna Musa. And Rosanna Musa is a ceramic artist and she loves making artists and they've formally established the, this brand and really making production in 2010. Rosanna started out this brand by just making their ceramic pots right behind their house, you know, and in, in the location of where, where they're situated, like the, the factory, it's just surrounded by, by paddy fields, like lots of rice, lots of rice paddy fields, and the locals call the, these type of rice, they're called bandang, so that's where their name comes from. So in 2010, they've shifted their production of behind Rosanna's house to an old building that used to be Rosanna's grandmother's place, and this old building used to be a grocery store, a really, really, really big, busy grocery store back in the 1950s. And then in 2018, Rosanna and Imaya Wong, who's also a designer, made the company called Bandang Artisan, and they have a pop-up shop right now in the link KL. So if you want to buy her products, you got to go to the link in Kuala Lumpur, and you got to watch out on her social media accounts to watch for the release dates, because they don't really they don't really have a fixed date of when the products might be available. They'll, they'll be available when it's available. So production is very limited. If you want to check out their products, you can check them online on their Instagram page and also their Facebook page. Watch out for these, these items. They're very, very limited. And when, once they're listed up, like to this morning, I didn't know they were open from 12 to 3 p.m. I had to wait in line in front of the store just to buy these beautiful bowls. So keep in line, get there early, and just appreciate these beautiful bowls. 